What's good, y'all? Welcome back to a brand new Comic Rex Lace issue. Issue number 35 of Taz. You're back. You might be wondering, Glenn, why aren't you excited? You're, you've been loving this arc up to this point, man. There was that one weird page with Peter sounded like the fucking Joker. But besides that, you would love this arc. Where is your enthusiasm? Where is your excitement? Well, as some of you guys may know, this issue leaked, or at least some pages of it leaked. I don't know how this keeps happening. Who's the ones with all these leaks? And I swear to God, it's only with like MJ issues there's leaks. Or the very least, wherever I know, actively know there are leaks that I end up seeing them on my feet or whatnot. Oh, by the way, Bullet Clip. Bullet Clip shirt's back. <laughs> back to wearing the Bullet Clip shirt. <sighs> anyway, so as I was saying, the issue leaked. And you guys know me, I don't look at leaks. You know, I avoid that shit. But. And I usually end up half the time not even really seeing them anyway. Um, but this one I did, uh, there was a page in this issue, assuming it is this issue. I mean, it could be from another issue. It might be the next issue for all I know. Because sometimes things like that happens. Sometimes with the leaks. But whatever. You know, I saw a page from this issue that I'm assuming is in there. And, uh, yeah. I'm sure if you guys have, were like on like the Spider-Man subreddit or whatnot, you probably know what page I'm thinking of. Uh, I won't say it, just, you know, not spoil anyone that manages to, uh, managed to not see any leaks and whatnot, man, but, uh, yeah. Oh, hopefully, you know, it's like that one weird page in the other issue where it's like, oh, just that one weird page and then the rest of the book, it's good. You know, like with, like, the last issue. Oh, God, why is this, how this arc falls so far, man? It started so good and just completely fell off a cliff, it looks like. Ugh, why do I keep letting this man cook? <laughs> Who keeps letting Zeb cook, man? Jesus Christ. Well, anyway, let's jump right in. I've been here many times before, in my lab, and gay engineering my fate. Craven carved that shaft in that, that, that carved the shaft himself. Enchanted it with a cere with ceremony to hold my sins. There you they yearn for you. But the spot but the spearhead was created to expel my misdeeds, and we must endure and we must ensure and we must ensnare them. If you asked me if you asked me if if you asked yesterday, I'd have told you I don't I don't know why I keep it. You know This curse weapon that that eats sins. Don't do don't do that It will come it will consume my darkness and the spear will hold it. Fool! Every, but everything will be okay. Lies! Craven watches, watches in judgment. He has decided he doesn't like guns. <laughs> Next page. Who the fuck is that? Hammerhead? Who is this guy? He knows they he knows they often destroy the ones who wield them. Red Hook. Who the fuck? What or who or what is Red Hook? We've been bickering with the owl, with the owl over Red Hook, over Red Hook for years. They got, they're gonna know it was us. No, they're gonna think it was us. But we're gonna tell Crime Master it was, it was not, it was Diamondback, and we'll tell Mister Negative Scoons that it was, that it was Black, that was like Black Mara. And before you know it, any of, any of them's gonna know it, that somebody's making moves, and if they want to keep their territory, they better be ready to fight for it. Won't that won't take much won't take much of a push from the from from there to tip to tip the war into our to tip the war to tip to tip us into a war. Ha! Huh, you're smarter than you look. Next page. Alright, back with Spidey and Paul. At least MJ looks amazing. Like I said, Patrick Lee's a man, he knows how to draw MJ. He really knows how to make her look awesome. The Holland the Holland Tunnel, how fitting. Who are they to look at me like that? To look at me like this? Do they do they know? Do they know what I could do to them? Queen Goblin, looking at me with pity, you're infected with the sins of Norman Osborn. Knowing how that feels, I can't leave you to carry this burden. My mind is fire. I can't hear her over the road. MJ, looking at me with fear. Peter, she's the one who left me. <sighs> Uh, so this is gonna be like throughout the entire issue. That can't be for him. Yeah, I'm with Peter on that one. I hate her. I hate them all. Next page. God damn! <laughs> I just took the fucking railing out and beat her with it. 
and makes me feel so alive. Paul, a word. Yes, please, please, please have a word with Paul, man. Don't worry. With MJ, we just want to talk, man. We just want to talk. You don't know where it's MJ. You don't got to worry about it. We're just going to have a nice, civilized, concise, constructive talk. That's all. I just want to worry. We just want to worry with him, man. We just want to worry with him, Jay, man. Come on. <laughs> Run. What? No. Run! He won't hurt. He won't hurt me. Isn't that right, Peter? Oh God, this is the. Yep. This is the fucking page where well, they turn Peter into a fucking incel. Ugh. I know he's like, bro. Does Norman even act like this? Is there ever a Green Goblin comic where? Norman acted like this, bro, where it would make sense if Peter started acting like a fucking insult. Like, I know he's got mind controlled and everything, but like, like with the last issue, that like, Norman, like, that's not like some Joker shit that he was saying, bro. Not like, not, not like Green Goblin. <sighs> this pains me, man, bro. Stan Lee and Steve are rolling in their fucking graves right now, man, seeing this shit. <laughs> They'd be like, look what, the, look how they massacred my boy. <laughs> Whoa, 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 where'd you get that? Where'd you get that thing? All right, he gave it to you. The weasel who took you from me. He is right. Paul's a fucking weasel. Fuck weasels. All my homies hate weasels. I'm a big girl, Peter. Nobody took me anywhere. And it was you, my jackpot. You betrayed me. Do you think you wouldn't pay? It pains me to read this. Whatever, we're past it now. We got through it quickly. So let's see if I can enjoy the rest of the book in peace. You know, with relative, with my sanity relatively intact. <sighs> this arc started so good too, man. This arc started so amazing and now we're here. I swear to God, that's just the thing with Zev's Roman. Every time an arc starts off promising minus tombstone, it always just gets shafted. If like, like the whole stuff with like Peter backstory, we're like, oh, what did he do? What did he do? with be fucking nothing. You know, it started off really good. You guys all say, hey, like, hey, oh, 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 let this man cook, let the man cook. Then we figured out what happened, man. To be fair, the issue itself wasn't as bad as I thought it was going to be, but you know, still. But this is worse. This is worse. But the beginning issues were definitely better as well. Uh, anyway, enough crying, boy. You've come to your. You've come to the end of my kindness. You won't rob me of my revenge. I've got. I gave everything to prepare to prepare Orisborn for his sins. If you won't return them, I'll tear them out with you. I'll tear them out with your throat. Next page. Oh, uh, hey. Alright. I don't care what's gotten into him. No one's killing Peter Parker today. And Patrick Leeson makes Patrick looks so amazing here, man. She looks so cute. I love this outfit she's wearing too. Ugh, the, the, I swear I'm getting fucking whiplash with this but one minute I hate it, the next one I'm like, oh you know, it's good. I don't know, it's just, I'm getting fucking whiplash with this fucking book, oh, man, Jesus. No one's killing Peter Parker today. Yeah. Talk your shit, MJ. A too late for a romantic gesture, MJ. Fuck you. Oh. <laughs> what the fuck is this pose, man? That fucking smile he got going on, bro. Where are the rip marks on his mask? There's only one thing that's gonna square us. I'm gonna hurt you as much as you hurt me. See what I mean? <laughs> Jesus fucking Christ, my man looks like he's about to fucking... Oh wait, is he going after Paul? Never mind, never mind, never mind, we're good, we're good, never mind, never mind. Never mind. I take back what I said, man, I thought it was talking about MJ, but no, he's talking about Paul. Never mind, yes, yes, Peter, yes, get him, finish him. Something that I know works from experience. <laughs> you never should have come to this world, Paul. You don't belong here. Uh, I'm not going anywhere. You do what you gotta do. Works for me! <laughs> yes! Drop him! Drop him! Drop him! Let him die! Please! Give me some fucking catharsis! Spider, this is unworthy of you. No, it's not! No, it's not! Let him die! Let him die! Do tell. 
Next page. I've... I don't even get the suspect of hearing his neck snapped! Imagine they actually did that. They like did Gwen again, but this time MJ fall fails to St. Paul and it snaps his neck. That would have been funny. And I would have liked that. But no! We can't have nice things in this book, apparently. Besides Patrick Leeson doing the artwork, but even then, like I said, he's been doing every issue. It shouldn't be, it should, there shouldn't be this many ma magic, massive gaps between him whenever he's doing the armor, because he's amazing. I've got you. Damn it, I'm just... And then we get another amazing MJ panel again from Patrick Leeson, man. For fuck's sake, man. I'm sorry you two got dragged into this. I'll take you from here. Peter will be okay. Norman, what's, what are you going to do? I enjoy getting to know you, Mary Jane. Next page. Yo, Peter now looks like a straight up demon. <laughs> I hobbled here, spy. I hobbled you. I, ho I hobbled you. Hobbled? Is that supposed to say like humble, but like in his Russian accent or something? You spider, poison you with evil meant for another. I've got it. Uh, I've come to get to end this. I bet I be. I beat you easily, Craven. Threw you into a grave for fun. I'm gonna hurt you so bad. I know. Come then! Alright, hell yeah. So we hold me go back to that priest page. Yeah, the way his, his mask is kinda of, looks kinda of weird, like with the way it looks kind of anyway. Just bro, Peter looks like a fucking demon right now, bro. Looks good, looks good. Patrick leads him man, he don't miss. Did you forget to drink your your potions, tough guy? You've been skipping your weird ceremonies. I'll start I'll start one for you. Going Gong, gong, gong. <laughs> Damn, he's like. <laughs> See what happens when you fight me fair? You all, you're always been a cheater. You and you, you were always a noble adversary. Why are you so happy? <laughs> Next page. What are you smiling about? Was he not? Invent, like, are we sure that he got Norman sin and not Joker's? <laughs> like seriously, man. I'm grateful, Spider. I'm thankful for you. You put me into you put me in the grave with my father's gun, and it and I did not follow him. There was a voice in my head, the voice that took my father's mother, the voice that that, that took him. It's gone, Spider. I faced the darkness and I did not pull the trigger. I know this now, however I die, but it will not be by my hand. You have given me a great gift. I owe you this. I owe you your salvation. I strike. Damn, he's like, damn, he's like breaking his freaking back. The only person that got his back broken is fucking Paul. And my sins come loose. For a moment, I lost myself. I'm back in my lab. Re-engineering -engineer, my fate. My sins collapse, as if eager to come home. And it does. MJ, I did. What the fuck is this bullshit, man? Like, no, 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 man. Like, what is this bullshit here, man? You, bro, this got to be the most bipolar comment I have ever read in my life, bro. Like, you guys know I'm getting tonal whiplash at every other fucking page, bro. But now, now, after all this time, Peter's out here acting like a fucking incel, MJ and Peter, and now here you got MJ cradling Peter, hugging him, consoling him, as if they're still together. Like, what is this bullshit? Are you trying to make up for lost time, Paul? Paul uh, fucking, um... Zeb? You know, I was slipping on his name for a second. Like, uh, like the, what the fuck is this shit? Like, is this trying to make up for lost time? Like, bro, are you trying to tell us that you want them together, but Marvel is holding you at gunpoint? Like, literally, bro, I swear to God, at this point, at this fucking point, what's going on at the, at the Spider Office, bro? It is what's going on in X-Force, man. Like, Marvel is Colossus's brother, and Zeb Wells is the chronicler. Like, that is what's going on. They're basically holding this man at gunpoint to write this shit. <laughs> I guarantee that's what's going on, bro. X-Force is an actual biography of what's going on in the Spider office right now bro i guarantee you i guarantee you at this point that's what's going on bro x-force is actually a secret bio bi biography of what's going down the spider office and this is their way this is like percy whatever his name is way of telling you like guys 
This ain't, we don't want this. This is Marvel's editorial telling us to do this, man. I guarantee you, bro, because nothing else makes sense. Why are we now getting these sudden pages as if, like, you got PMJ smiling for you, like, bro, like, if this was any other time, bro, I'd be so happy about this, man. I'd be like, yes, yes, perfect. But no, with this shit, I know it's all bullshit, and I know nothing's gonna happen. Like, why are you giving me this, like, <laughs> this block? I'm just all over the goddamn place, man. At least the arm went like, you didn't do anything wrong. Yeah, I know, Peter. But I want to say, and you deserve to hear me say it after all. MJ, what did I do? Shh, it's okay, Peter, that wasn't you. Why is she acting like they're still together? Does MJ want to be together with them too? But like... Uh, <laughs> I'm so confused. <laughs> Why is this book out here giving me so many fucking mixed signals, bro? Like, I would love these kind of pages, bro. This is the shit I live for when Peter and when it comes to Peter and MJ. But no, no, I can't fucking enjoy it. It's like what happened with fucking Bambi. You know, when we got to see some banter around right the end. I, any other time, I would enjoy this. I would make some memes and jokes that should have been me sucking on Bambi's skin. But no, we got Giselle in there. So now I got, okay, now I got her doing that whole thing. I'm like, this, I can't even fucking enjoy this. The meal has been poisoned. The meal has been ruined. I'm not even making fucking sense right now, man. <laughs> Anyone that isn't caught up with Bleach is probably wondering what the fuck I'm talking about, man. If you're caught up on Bleach, you know. You know what's going on with Bambi, bro. That was... Fuck Giselle. Seriously. Fuck Giselle. Anyway. I must go before he collect, collects himself. The spear. I will biff. I will bind it in the ceremony and bury it in the ground. I already have the hole. Neither it nor I will bother you again. You are free, Osborne. He believes that you can hear in his voice, but he doesn't. But he doesn't see her. In the distance, how long has he been? Has she been watching? How long has she been smiling? And is it me, or is the smile content? Next page. <sighs> okay. Uh, da days later. The damage to the Holland Tunnel provide proves again that our city doesn't have the resources to deal with Supercron. We have to do something. It sure doesn't look like it's going away, Norman. Randy is fired. Is, fed, is fired up. Wait, is that Randy? Is that something Randy? It doesn't have to go away, Peter. It just has to go get away from you. Luckily, you were wearing a costume that's become an associate with with one Brock or another. They'll never know it was you, but it was. No, Peter, it wasn't. I know that more than anyone. Take some time off, get some rest. Time off? I don't know, Norman. I found there's only one cure for a guilty conscience. Once again, amazing armor from Patrick. I did what I had to do. My sins are no longer in Peter. The spear was made to hold them, but... Say it! But I knew it wouldn't. The spear is not, is not their home. I am. I had to say, Peter, I didn't have time. But I know. But I knew. If given the chance, my sins would come home. Once again, amazing. <laughs> oh! He laughed. He laughed. He laughed. Green Goblin returning soon? Question mark? I know this is probably going to be the start of a new, like, 25-issue arc is coming up next, apparently. So I guess Gang Wars is going to be a little bit later on, uh, later, later on. Oh, yeah, I saw something about Miss Marvel. In here, wait. Okay, hold on. This I got to read. Yo, this, yo, hold on. Yo, hold on. I got to read this one. Yo, hold on. This one I got to read. We got one in here from... From someone from Washington, I saw a part of this one that had something about Miss about uh, Miss Marvel. So I want to know what this says. I want to know what this says. It's probably given the fact that it was printed, it's not anything too bad. I know, but like, let's see, let's see well this is worded. Okay, Sadak, thank you so much for reading, writing in. He would say, okay, hello, there, here we go. Hello again, folks. So, how much more are we expecting? To, are we expected to take? Zeb Wells has hit us with so many gut punches on on his run. I'm reeling. First, Mary Jane has kids, an issue one. Then Spidey consoles can console, can, consolidate, cons, cons, 
consolates whatever with con whatever Trumpstone's control over the mob, and Peter goes to goes to work for of all people Norman Osborn, Gwen's murderer. Yes, yes. Then Ned Leeds becomes Hopgoblin, a real jolt for somebody who has been reading Spider-Man since 1977. Goddamn, bro, you. My, 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 my regards to you, bro. You have been through so much. You have been through so much. Godspeed to you, bro. <laughs> I'm praying for you. <laughs> Immediately after which, Ben Riley goes after Spidey. Ben Riley and the Scarlet Spider. Next, Elder Blue Marvel's killed and Miss, Miss Marvel's killed off the book. Seriously, Zeb. Okay, well, that one was probably out of your control, editors. Am I right? Yeah. <laughs> probably, to be fair, probably. What a great time for Felicia to break up with Peter, right? And well, at least things couldn't get any worse. What the? Peter has absorbed Norman and spins, and he's laughing like a green goblin, but, but. Come on, Zeb, give us a break. Maybe six months without anything traumatic happening. Just Spidey fighting the kangaroo, <laughs> the kangaroo, the grizzly baby, please. Well, until they make Zeb Wolf Spider-Man, mine, make mine Marvel. Okay, so, yeah, it was nothing. <laughs> I thought it might have been like a, sli like a slightly, like slightly, uh, strongly worded email, but no, no. Oh, God, this cover goes hard, bro. Mm -mm. All right. That is the end of the issue and the end of my suffering. At least for one week. Ugh. Anyway. Okay. Okay. I will not call this issue bad just from the stack that Patrick Gleason did the artwork, man. No issue he does is bad just by this just by him, just with how good his art is by itself. But obviously you guys saw how I was reacting in my thought process throughout the issue. Good moments, bad moments. But man, did this arc fall off a cliff, bro. Start up so good. Start up so good. And no, and we do not get even the slightest bit of life. Bro, as long as if, if, if Peter was able to throw a punch at Paul, I would be content if we just got a punch. But no, I swear they purposely are trying, are protecting this fucking dude. Like, they will not give us anything. Anyway, guys, overall, I'm going to give this issue an 8 out of 10. And that's just mostly from Patrick Leeson's artwork. I'm not kidding. His art is that fucking good. That gets that high. Just for that. Anyway, guys, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Like if you did, subscribe if you're new. Follow me when I told you. If you feel like it, the link subscribe down below. And as always, come back for more. See you guys next time.